I've talked earlier about information for the attorney. I must admit that my great hope here is that attorneys will jump on board and begin to take on these cases. There are major law firms all across the country who have united and are working for HOAs, collection companies, management companies. The uniting of attorneys that are against them aren't there. Why? There's no money. For the attorney, I will say it again. I believe you're making a mistake by not viewing what's happening here as a tort. The damage to the homeowner. There are damages, psychological, physiological, punitive. I now bring into that fraud, equity theft. These homeowners are being robbed of their equity as a result of fines and fees being charged to them that aren't warranted. And if they try to stop them, they simply bring on more fees. This, in my opinion, is equity theft. I also think it's racketeering. I think these things can be proven. I've admitted I'm not an attorney. I also believe the following. C, C, and R's are contracts. My understanding of a contract is, is that two people, our people, must enter into it and agree. I agree to sign the CC and R's. You agree that that's what I'm going to do. You agree to abide by them, but they don't. Has the contract not been broken? And as a result of it being broken, I want to end my contract with the CC and R, but remain in my home. I'm asking you to give it some thought. I don't know the answer to it. I'm not, the, I'm not that trained. I'm asking you to give it some thought.